Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. I love talking about self-love skincare and makeup. So if that's the sort of thing that you enjoy, then please keep on watching. I have quite a deep pan in my MAC Studio Fix Compact and it's becoming difficult to collect product onto my brush. So I decided to repress this compact and I thought I will film this video for you all. This is a technique that you can do for any powder product that you have which you've either broken or in which you have quite a deep pan. So first thing that I'm doing is I'm using the back end of my eyebrow tweezers to completely crush the pre-existing product and to really reduce it to a crumble. This takes a bit of time but is also satisfying. So essentially you scrape the product from the sides and then you collect it towards the center. And once it's, it's gotten to the center, you try breaking the bigger chunks into smaller chunks as fine as possible. Now there are multiple ways of doing this. A lot of people like to crush the product in a completely separate container but I find that leaves quite a bit of mess and you also lose a lot of product when you're transferring from container to container so I just prefer working with the container that I already have so as you can see I'm just working in small sections and trying to gather the product towards the center without spilling much of it as much as possible next you need some rubbing alcohol the brand doesn't really matter all you can go is go to the local chemist and ask for rubbing alcohol now the 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 bottle that i have is the one that is used to disinfect before surgeries or disinfect wounds so i'm using a cap full of the rubbing alcohol and literally pouring it into this container initially i tried to be a bit more neat but it was very difficult to really control so i've literally poured the alcohol and now i'm making i'm mixing it i'm using it as like a mixing medium and just mixing the product with the rubbing alcohol it does look a bit messy but it is what it is so you just want to take your time and mix it as much as you can and try to make sure that there are no lumps in the product while you're mixing it don't get don't be afraid to get dirty and use your fingers out there it's absolutely fine as long as you've cleaned your hands and fingers and sanitized them properly and uh, yeah just keep doing this and try to collect the product bang at the center of the pan that you have Next, I'm using a dry tissue and pressing very, very lightly. You don't want to put too much pressure, just very light pressure to kind of make sure that all of this collects in a particular shape. And you can see that the shape is slowly forming and you want to do this multiple times to sort of make sure that the product is not wet anymore from the alcohol. And I'm also cleaning the edges. And there you have it, a completely repressed compact, which is a lot more easier to use. And you can use the same technique for other broken products, say eyeshadow or blush. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please consider liking, sharing, commenting and subscribing to this channel. Thank you and see you the next time. Bye.